Hi Virgo, it's Elle here to do a quick reading for you. So we're going to go, we're going to see how your person feels about you and how you feel about your person. What's the outcome and what is the advice for you, okay? So let's get into it, Virgo. All right. So Virgo, how do you feel about your person? Okay. The Two of Cups, very nice. So you feel like if there's been problems, you want forgiveness to happen. You just... You just want to dead the situation. You want bygones, bygones to be bygones. Just agree to disagree. It's over. You feel like it's a mutually beneficial relationship, um, partnership. You feel like uh, it could work. There's a lot of love between the two of you. You could be dealing with the cancer or uh, a cardinal sign. I don't know. Someone with cancer in their chart. Venus and cancer. Leave so. You feel like you've worked on yourself. You've a lot of self-love. So you feel like you're ready to give to this connection. Um, maybe you've spent a lot of time by yourself. And now you're ready to come back to this Virgo. How does your person feel about you? Wow. The justice card. Um... Could be dealing with a Libra. They feel like they want to do the right thing. They want to balance the scales here. Um, they feel like cause and effect. Like maybe they were the cause to this change, to this um, maybe a negative change, maybe a breakup or just a, a shutdown or um, a, a walking away from. Um, they feel like they want to apologize to you. They feel indebted to you. Uh, they feel like karmically they need to clear the karma with you. They always want to be in good standing with you, Virgo. Uh, let's see. They feel like uh, right and wrong. Something about right and wrong. Just let bygones be bygones. It's over. It's said and done. It is what it is at this point. Uh, let's see what the outcome is between you and your person. What's the outcome between the page of pentacles very nice so it looks like you guys are going to go back into this connection with a course of of action a plan this talks about having a plan uh seeing it through uh the new beginning the start of um you guys you're going to be diligent because you're desiring to be with each other to make it work also um this looks good for the most part. It just looks like maybe there was a hiccup here, a breakdown in communication, a breakup, a fight. Somebody's not getting what they want here. Uh, so maybe someone withdrew. But it looks like you guys will be coming back together. What's the best advice for Virgo? What's the best advice for Virgo here? Best advice for Virgo. Eight of Cups. Soul searching. Once again, um... You need to go so soul searching to, to determine where is your happiness. What it what are you happy about? Um, this is a personal journey here. Um, you might need to check out of this. Look, if you're not getting exactly what you want here, then you need to determine how can you get exactly what you want with this Eight of Cups. It looks like you've got enough. But it's something else that you want. You want these two of cups. You want maybe um, harmony uh, to come together, to live together, to be together, um, to be in a committed relationship. Um, you're doing something just because it's the right thing to do, but you're not happy about it. What's the eight of cups? Why is the eight of cups here for Virgo? Yeah, the Ace of Pentacles. Um, you want an opportunity. You're not seeing an opportunity to have what it is you want, to start something new, to have something foundational. You're understanding that the start is not going to determine the beginning. Whatever transpired between the two of you doesn't mean that it's going to always be that. If it was good, doesn't mean it's always going to be good. If it was bad, doesn't mean it's always going to be bad. You just want the opportunity to have something solid and stable between the two of you you want to know that you are actually putting your work into something that's going to grow you it's almost as if there's an unknowing like you just don't know it's like more work more effort more time more love into what 
what am I getting from this? Um, but you feel like this is your soulmate. This is where you need to be. Maybe this is an energy of, you know, feeling like this person is in your system. It's systemic. You feel good here. You feel at home with this person. And maybe there was like a growing up or coming of age with this person. Maybe you made significant milestones with this person, bought a home, had a child, started a business, so on and so forth. Um, to where you feel like, yeah, it's it's kind of systemic. It's hard for you to break this bond, to leave. And you also feel like this is your soulmate. All right, let's see. Um, someone is saying I have to stay with my family. So if someone is coupled here but wanting to be somewhere else, wanting the opportunity to be somewhere else, it looks like they're going to do what is right. Again, what I was talking about, someone doing the right thing. Someone wants the other person to know uh, you are beautiful. Very nice. All right. Oh, someone said, wait for me. Yeah, this looks like somebody stuck somewhere, stuck in something. They want to be somewhere else with maybe someone who is on the outside of a relationship who they feel is their soulmate. The two and the six of cups is the eight of cups. Somebody wants to walk away to another person, but they can't due to this obligation in the justice with the justice card and the page of pentacles. Someone is saying, I would say I love you, but I don't know what love is at the bottom of the deck. Someone could be a player, an F boy or an F girl, just out to get what it is they want to get here or what they can get from a situation. Um, someone may be definitely feeling the loss of the ramifications of choosing another, wanting to be somewhere else, wanting to come back. Virgo, if this resonates with you, go over to the website, book your own reading there. Take advantage of the text question where you can text a question to the number below. Pay for your question all on your mobile device. You can also donate to the channel. If you're feeling like you took something from the reading, you can give back by clicking the buy me a coffee link. Yep, you could buy me a coffee if you're feeling moved to do so. Also, you can go to the website, book a reading there. Thank you, Virgo. Take care. Many blessings.